We are in... Hi everyone, uh, welcome to Millie's Match Day Challenge. We're just waiting for Jill to arrive. Um, while we wait for Jill, I just wanted to say a massive thank you to everyone that's donated already. Make sure you head over to my bio and there's a link in there for my Just Giving page so you can donate. Um, I hope you all have fun today. Let's keep raising awareness for this amazing charity, Make-A-Wish. Uh, my aim is to grant as many wishes as possible and keep raising the awareness um, for this important cause. I hope you all have fun. We've got Jill taking us through the warm-up. We've also got Erin Cuthbert and um, Samantha Kerr. Just trying to add Jill in. Waiting for Jill. Hi, Rach Daly. Can see you there. Guys, we will be doing a Q&A at the end of the challenge um, with Erin. But yeah, we're just going to go for a warm up. Jill's going to give us some top tips and um, show us some new skills ready to kick off at two. When she, I think Jill needs a lesson on Instagram. Waiting for Jill. Will Erin dance? Um, yeah, we can ask Erin to do a dance. I hope she's watching. I hope Sam's watching and they're getting prepared, uh, practicing their skills. Here she is. Hi, Hello. Jill. Hello. You okay? I was getting nervous As you can then. see, Jill, I've got my anthem jacket on. I've also got my Chelsea shirt on underneath, which is the giveaway. Oh. So, guys, make sure you're sending your videos after the event. I was just saying, you know Jill, what? a massive thank you. Yeah. I was going to put my city stuff on and I thought I'll be kind, you know, with England team mate. That's it. Chelsea You're City, going down. big game. I miss those games. <laughs> I miss them. Uh, yeah, so oh, we're going to take through one, Jill, you are, and then you're going to count us down for kickoff. Okay, perfect. I'll have to maybe put my camera there. It's on salty. Right, so first of all, what a great thing you're doing, Millie. Uh, thanks for picking me. I think it's because you want Chelsea to win. So you've gone with Sam Kerr, <laughs> Owen Cuthbert, and then let's pick the weak link at City. So I see what you mean. You're so, definitely right, not the weak link, Jill. It's important we'll warm up. Do you want to do it with the ball or whatever you want, to Coach Jill? Obvious, Jill. Well, let's be honest. Me and you hate warm ups, don't we? So let's yeah. do it with the football. All right. Okay. So just fan oh. off. We'll just go inside of your feet, just moving the ball. Lots of touches. This is a 15 minute warm up. I'm going to be knackered. <laughs> Anyone right. taking part in the match day challenge, make sure you're following Jill's warm up. Right, next one, Millie. Little toe taps. Can you see? I'll go back a bit. Yeah. I know, oh, I'm going to have to go back a bit. Have you seen how red my glass is? <laughs> <laughs> Off these football sessions. Right, Millie, let's try a little dance. Can you see? Can you I see? never look for. So we're going to go touch, touch, touch. So just like that. Oh, God, Jill. Come on, you've got it. One, two, three. I've seen your TikToks. Yeah, what? that's not dancing. Jill, I actually can't get this because I'm, I'm facing the opposite way. Come on. Right. Yeah. One, two behind. One, two behind. Oh my god, I've actually got it, guys. Yeah, I can see. Bitch I think I need to do some <laughs> obvious Jill sessions. Bitch, I'll feel he's going to be jealous of this. <laughs> <laughs> right. Can you hear us? Have a little breather. I think I might have to go to some stretches. Yeah, that's fine. Let's stretch the legs. We'll do some high knees. Get the blood pumping. Let's take it back to the back. Come on, Got all the information on. Left hand down. Come on, left hand. Right hand. Up for a header. Oh, I won that one, Jill. <laughs> I'll beat you again. <laughs> Two hands down. <laughs> Another header. I've been working on my jumps. 
Just checking, guys. That's 10 minutes till kickoff. And let's stretch. Point to your calves. I'm going to come close so I can speak to you. Calf stretch. Yeah. Jill, what do you make to Millie's Match Day Challenge? No, it's brilliant. I um, I seen that on Instagram. I didn't request to be in it, but obviously, as I said before, <laughs> you picked the week link. I picked uh, the big characters, you know. And I thought it would be was, obvious, Jill. I was a trying coach to get involved. I was trying some of the challenges that you put on for the children. And this one, I couldn't get the the oomph in the hand. <laughs> That's a hard one. So we worked out that Jill needs some more upper body sessions. <laughs> definitely. definitely. Well, you know, it was the hardest one for me, the knees and keeping it like close to you. Otherwise it runs away. Yeah. You know what? I'm not what? too bad at knees. I think it's because my knee length is so long. I'm not actually too yeah, bad. I think it's because you're like six foot five. I'll take Owen Cuthbert on in this one. She's got a little leg. <laughs> well, <laughs> you're going to give us some top tips now and maybe some tricks that I can try out when we're ready for kickoff. And also, don't forget, when you take on the challenge at 2pm with me, Sam and Erin are then going to be joining me after to see if they can beat you. So it is a competition. Yeah. Well, should we start off? Let's try this trick, yeah. really, right? So... We'll start off easy. Put the ball like this. Okay. This is gonna this is gonna hurt. Are you on concrete or grass? Concrete, but it's fine. Are you sure? <laughs> yeah, it's fine. Well, can you do a forward roll? <laughs> on concrete. <laughs> Come on, you're hard. Come on. So like that. Forward roll. And then you're gonna let the ball roll down and just sort of keep you up. Right, I mean, <laughs> she's gonna hurt sure herself. Gonna punch him. <laughs> Come on, Lily, do it for the charity. <laughs> Guys, if you've not, if you are outside, just improvise with a bit of garden <laughs> furniture. <laughs> Come on, forward ball. There she goes. Right, you can't see me, guys, but I am doing. You keep your fears. That was decent. No, I did it. Right, try and do it. This is when I smack myself in the chin, right? So, knees and then catch. Oh, forward ball. Oh, oh I forgot the forward ball again. What? I think I'll skip the forward ball, but I'll do the knees. Go on, then try and catch it. Right. Oh, it's harder than you think. Watch your chin. I can't do the knees one. Guys, I need a lot of practice at this. <laughs> Millie, just do this. You ready? So. Yeah. Come back with it <laughs> as if you did it. Go out the camera. There you go. <laughs> Guys, I hope you're all taking part in Jill's tricks. Um, I'm finding them a lot, very, very difficult. So I need to work on these during quarantine. We are approaching five minutes before kickoff. Jill, have you got any skills for us? Oh, skills? No, you have Anything that we can do during the Keep You Up Challenge, whether it's outside about, of the court. What about the lunge when it hits your knee? So you yeah, let's give it a go. Two, three. Lunge. 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 Oh, I'm trying not to put my leg down on the concrete. No, that was good. Millie, I've got a confession. I've just ripped my trousers. <laughs> Live on Instagram. <laughs> that is dedication to make a wish, Jill. I love it. Oh, Guys, don't put your trousers at home. <laughs> you want me a pair of trousers, but you give us your one. best keepy up is. What about uh, just keep you up? Yeah, just any variation you want. What about trying? Oh, I'm not that good, you know. I'm 33 now. Outside. Your age is just an inside. Oh. Get your last little bit of practice in, guys. We're nearly approaching kickoff. That's decent, that, Millie. Right, I'll try and do my. That is good. Just before we go live, um, 
as soon as this is done, I just want to say I'll be heading over to your Instagram page to make a donation. And I think thank you very much. Make a wish is fantastic. Fantastic. Yeah, my aim um, is to grant as many wishes as possible, um, and just keep raising awareness. You know, for something that is for an unbelievable cause, um, especially during this this quarantine period and you know, not being able to get out there. So it's doing as much as we can, whether it's Instagram Live or whatever it might be. So, yeah, that's my aim. Grant as many wishes as possible. But, yeah, thank you for your donation. It is massively appreciated. No, that's fine. I think, obviously, giving children that memory um, or something that they would never have got to do, I think it's just a fantastic charity. So, well in Mills. I know we have to hate each other on game day, but, you know, I love you really. <laughs> <laughs> Never hate, all love, love for the game, love for the game. Right, right. Well, let's see how many headers we can do. Not done any headers, headers yet. Okay. Let's just work on so headers. I'm trying to get as much practice in as possible. Right. Come on, then. I mean, I'm good at heading it in a game on a one off. No one ever wins a header against you. <laughs> Might try one of my variations. Come on, then, Millie, do headers and give us a number. Three. Give us a number. Oh. Do headers and give us a number. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, ah! eight. eight. You lost your ball. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, yes, eight as well. Eight as well. <laughs> wow, it's a draw. Chelsea won, City won. Oh, it's a draw. <laughs> <laughs> what a game, what a game the last one was. I think we should uh, yeah. um, mention oh. that game. I'm just going to have a quick uh, look through at some of the comments. Okay. Um, Chelsea. Millie, you're Rachel my must be up caller. early in America. Rachel dedicates herself to me because she's my best friend, so she's oh. definitely awake. I can assure you that. <laughs> I'm going to do some tricks with the ball and tag you. Look out for them then, Millie. Yeah, let's see. Guys, I'm not the best at tricks, so I'm going to let Jill show you these. No, not me. I was reading your comments. No, you. Come on. I've seen yeah. that. Jill. That was nice, Jill. <laughs> What's the one where you was going laces, outside, laces, outside? Yeah. That one's hard, though. That took a few takes. This is the thing when it's live. You have to do it. Yeah, oh. and guys, just so you know, when me and Jill go live in three minutes, 2 p.m. kickoff, it is a one take wonder. So there's no pre recordings. We get whatever score we get. Um, but again, it's all fun and games. It's for a great cause. But let's have a little bit of competition because we are footballers after all. You'll have noticed so. that was all right foot because I don't have a left foot. So Jill, that's fine. You can use this quarantine period to yeah. get back. Kids, if you're watching, always practice your weaker foot, because I didn't. I was quite impressed then. Let's go left foot then. Left foot only. Oh, no, honestly. It's embarrassing. I, can't, I don't even think I can do one. Oh, I've improved too. <laughs> 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90. I've got 20 then. I even, As I said. I even platted my hair. Look, I even platted my hair. Your, um, Match day rituals, have you got any? Mine? Um, yeah, you got any things that you have to do on match day? Like you've done your I hair always, for us. Yeah, I always touch the um, tunnel as we walk out. I think that's because I'd probably touch it anyway with my height. <laughs> <laughs> Push it up. <laughs> what about you? Mine's my hair. Um, I've gone for the messy bun, which I go for absolutely every day. Um, yeah. But yeah. I have a feeling that if my hair doesn't feel right, then I have to keep taking it out and starting again. And uh, to be fair, I keep getting a lot of people um, asking for a tutorial, but it's just, there's no real like way of doing it. It just has to feel right. But that okay, literally is my, real. send my mum a text. My mum always messages me, dream big, shine bright. And I always have to message her a blue heart back. Um, oh. uh, like my two things, but that's it. Oh, that's cute. Right, that's Jill, cute. we are one minute away from kickoff, so. Yeah. Let's get set and you're going to blow the whistle at two, yeah? Oh, I've been practising this whistle. Ready? Get ready. And Is I'm going just... to time us. What time have you got Sam on? Ten past? Sam's on at ten past, yeah. So if, um, once we've dropped it, if we just do a little freestyle, you can do some obvious Jill moments. Right, we're ready? Okay. Let's go. Go, 
I'm dropping Jill. I'm concentrating. I'm just going left foot, right foot for now, guys. I'm just going to do some right. Pulling the odd left. My knees. Thank you to everybody that's taking part and made your donations. Again, the link is in my bio. Oh, the pressure's on. Jill, have you done any tricks yet? Oh! Have you, you dropped beat it? it? You beat yes. us. I'm actually devastated. Right, I'm going to try a trick, Jill. Come on then. Oh, yes. But just for the record, a, a defender beat Jill Scott, who's a midfielder. Thanks. Oh. You know what? You're killing my obvious Jill sessions because I've won that. I think I could reveal. This is the signed shirt <laughs> that's going to be given away, guys. Because I beat Jill, I thought I'd get it out. You know. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, make sure you send in your videos once you finish. This is a signed shirt that you're within a chance of winning. Uh, Jill, let's go for a freestyle, seeing as though we were. That great at keeping yeah. up. In. That wasn't very good then. Why don't That's you try uh... freestyle now? Okay. I can do that. Any tricks then? I'm just going to see what Jill's doing. See if I can oh. uh... loosen the ball. What about this one? Oh, that actually hit me ball. Guys, this is also good to see that sometimes the professionals don't always succeed, but we never <laughs> give in. We always keep going. Like I said, one take wonder. I'm just going to have a flick through while Jill's doing that just to see any comments. I will respond to your questions um, <laughs> after with Erin. I'm going to try and fall the ball. Jill, how many keepy uppies did you get? Oh, not many. What about keeping it up on the floor? Yeah, let's try that one. Thank you, Amy. She said she's donating one pound for every keepy up as she does. Massively appreciated. Thank you for taking part. Right, I'm gonna give your one a go then, Jill. Well, let's have a com let's have a sitting down competition. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Are we going? <laughs> He's been practicing. Oh, I've got 23, Jill. I've stopped. Jill's froze. <laughs> I did get more. Keep, I got I'm more. still going. What did you get? Uh, I didn't count. Oh, damn. She got more. <laughs> Millie, why don't you try the Ronaldo 7? <laughs> you didn't count. Well, you last longer than me anyway. <laughs> right, I'm going to go. Left foot, right foot, and then you've got to go two to the right, two to the left, three to the right, three to the left. Yeah? So, you go one. Oh, terrible right. spot. One, two, one. Four, one, two, three, four. Whoa! I don't know if anybody saw that, but I just nearly knocked the phone off. Yes, Jill! Six. Yes! Seven. Well, Jill is clearly beating me at this one as well. I'm just yeah, gonna... you, won. you won when it mattered, mate. That's a, that's a difference. Jill, I'm practicing. I've actually been practicing all your obvious Jill sessions. So oh, yeah. if I don't if I don't return to football with like technically better, I'm going to be disappointed because I've been doing all of them. I'm hoping like, all small circle guys keep it. Keep it <laughs> <laughs> Millie, let's try Ronaldo seven. So let so let's go. Two, two knees, two shoulder, head. Right, let's go then. Ready? Yeah. You going? Oh, missed it. Oh, oh, oh. oh, I got your shoulder. Are you still going? Did you do it. I did it. I got to my right shoulder. I got two, two, oh. and then I failed. One more try. Oh, 
Ready? I, I think I keep smart. starting on the last. I can't get to the other somebody's, side. Somebody's water commenting any tips to keep fit. And I just have to say there isn't. You've just got to run. I know. Yeah, I know just get out, get active. Even get in your garden. Yeah, um, exactly. What else have you said? Right, we've got five minutes left. Um, just using this time, Jill, what have you been doing during uh, your quarantine to keep active? What have you been Can doing? I sit down? Can I sit down now for two minutes? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. Hope everyone's still doing their videos. Oh, well done if I'm you are still going. Me and Jill lasted for two minutes. <laughs> I'm getting old, you know. That's why I'm doing this so that um, I can go into some coaching or something. Um, but yeah, isolation, just I've been trying to train um, most days. I've got a little makeshift gym with me little two kilogram weights for me little biceps. <laughs> um, and walking as well. I've been walking as well. What about you? Uh, someone's just said, have you ever had shin splints? I have actually, and they're the most painful thing I've ever had. Um, get plenty of rest, lots of ice, offload until they're gone. Um, me, I've actually been doing... Um, obviously I've been taking the dog for runs and walks, I've been doing some circuits on the garden um, and just trying to keep it like fun really, keep training fun I've also been doing some painting paint by numbers, oh, okay. I know that's not to keep fit but as to keep me sane mentally um, yeah. but yeah, have you got a message for people that are taking part in this challenge um, moving forward obviously with Make-A-Wish no, no I'm only joking <laughs> <laughs> typical no, Jill, think... obvious Jill <laughs> No, I think it's great. Um, obviously, getting Sam and Erin on as well and um, taking their time. I bet after watching this, they'll be very nervous to take on the challenges because of how good we've been. Okay. We're like world but... class standards, so they better be <laughs> afraid. There you go. Um, but no, I just think it's, a, as I said before, fantastic charity. Great that you're um, giving up that beloved shirt of yours. You can see you've got your badges on and everything. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, but. I think it's just a great thing that you do, doing, Millie, and it shows what a great person you are anyway, which we all know. So hopefully as soon as um, I've got off this, I'll donate and we can give some shout outs and hopefully get your target up as well. Yeah, definitely. Thanks, Jill. I think we no should worries. finish off with one last challenge, see if we can improve Wonderful. from our first attempt of keep your up is. Okay. Uh, you ready? Yeah, you can use grass as any body part. What is it? I think you need to put some grass seed on your garden, Jill. <laughs> It's all these obvious drill sessions. I've got no grass left. I can't believe I've ripped my trousers. <laughs> that is dedication. Right, final two minutes. Can we keep it up for two minutes? Two minutes? Yeah, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go on Remember, these. Erin Cuthbert and Samantha Kerr will be joining us. It will be Sam next and we'll see what she's got in store. I think I'm scared to do a trick because I'll drop it. This is all me, Sam Plumper. Might put a few outside of the trainer in. I can't talk because I'll drop the grass. Also, guys, don't forget to go and give Make a Wish a follow on Instagram and Twitter um, and see some, watch the videos of all the amazing stories. All the amazing kids that have been so strong through this period. Please show your support. It's much less. Oh. oh, I'm still going, Jill. I am just. Don't drop it. Oh, it should have been. I dropped. This year. Yeah. Okay. Do you know I did that whole thing on my on knees? Did you? Yeah, it's because my knees are so long. <laughs> well, not my right, knees, we've got a minute left. Right. And then, uh, Samantha will be. I just wanted to say a massive thank you, Jill, for coming on no um, and getting the awareness up. And obviously, you're going to donate. So that means the world to make a wish. So thank you on behalf of everyone. Thank you for entertaining me and showing me that I need to improve my technical skills, no. uh, which I will well, be practicing. Beat me. <laughs> <laughs> you beat me, yeah. honestly. <laughs> At least when. At least when you do these sessions recorded, you can keep doing them till the right. Yeah, well, I will keep practicing. But yeah. thanks a lot, and now I'm going to go and see what Sam Kerr can do and see if she can beat you. Right, take care. Well done.
Thanks so much, Jill. Bye. 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 Thank you. Right, now we're just going to add Sam in. Well done to everyone that took part in the challenge. Let's get the famous Sam Kerr involved. Here I have is. not got any skills like you. I was watching, I was like, oh my God. <laughs> I'm glad you've been watching. I've been watching, I, was, I commented, I was like, I've got no skills, you're making me look bad. To be fair, I was focusing that much on keeping the ball, that I didn't get close to the comments, but just thank you for me for coming on. Sam Kerr, everybody. <laughs> Absolute beast of a player. Um, so yeah, we just wanted to keep raising awareness really and I don't know if you saw the start of it, but my aim is just to grant as many wishes as possible uh, for an amazing cause and put as many smiles on kids' faces. So we thought this was a fun way of raising awareness and money. Um, so yeah, we wanted to challenge you and see what your keep up is like. I think I might have to just donate because I've got no skills. <laughs> I've seen you do the backyard like you guys. I'm in an apartment. My, my That's house. fine. You're mixing it up. Right. One of my make believe Chelsea gym. <laughs> Love it. Well, you're going to go first, and I'm going to see what you've got, and then we're going to have a challenge. Uh, okay. I'm just going to keep it up for now, okay? <laughs> yeah, that's fine. <laughs> I got two. See? Okay, here we go. One, two. Here she goes. Four, five. That's it. That's fine, keep going. You've got four minutes, it's fine. Okay, I just think that anything is possible because Sam's doing it in her house. I really hope you don't hit those photo frames behind you. Please don't yeah. make anything. <laughs> okay, come on. Yes, yes, <laughs> I told you, I said the new one was a, a challenge, it's hard. Right, Although so Jill Scott, did you see the one Jill was doing? She goes like this. Yeah, that and then do the flip. Yeah. Oh, Sam's going to do it in the house. Please don't hit yourself. <laughs> I still got her. Oh. So she goes like this. Oh, wait. I think I need a bit of work on that one. <laughs> right, I'm right, out. Me and you. With her knee and chin? Yeah, so she holds it there and then she like rolls over on it. Are you ready? Me and you. Let's go. Oh! Right, come on, me and you first to drop it. Okay. Unbelievable. Yeah, but Erin's got tickets. She was saying, I don't have tricks. I'm like, come on, Ez. I've seen you train. Yeah, I've seen her break people's ankles. <laughs> All right, one last challenge. Come on, one last one. Let's go. Okay. Chelsea shirt that I will be giving away, um, oh. one of my first ones. So, um, yeah, it's definitely a special shirt. Um, so, yeah, people have just got to donate, send in your videos um, from the challenge today, and I'll be picking out a winner this afternoon. Um, yeah. What's the record so far? Am I winning? Am I winning? Because I've, I've yeah, you're at the top of the leaderboard. <laughs> for sure. You're definitely at the top. 
Uh, but thank you for coming on. I'm now going to shoot over and get Erin in um, and see if Queen Erin can uh, top the leaderboard with the fancy skills that she puts on show week in, week out. All right, sweet as I'll be watching. Thanks, Sam. Um, no thank you so much. See you soon, mate. Bye. So, Samantha Kerr is at the top of the leaderboard, followed by myself, and then I think I beat Jill anyway. I'm sure I beat Jill. Thank you guys. I will get through your comments um, once me and Erin have taken each other on with the Keep People Challenge. Let's just get her in. Connected. Hey! Hello. Here she is. Hey, Hi, how are Erin. you? Hey. Guys, Erin Cuthbert, my Chelsea teammate and Scotland legend. Um, Ez, thank you for coming on board. The other two girls have been amazing. I'm sure you will be. Just want to say a huge thanks for taking time out to yeah help me get the awareness really needed for this unbelievable cause and all for raising money. Uh, but most of all, I think putting smiles on people's faces. So thank you so much. No, not a problem. It's a great cause. So let's get everyone involved and donate as much as we can. Thank you. Firstly, you've been saying you've not got a lot of skills, but I can see you week in, week out on the training pitch and you turn the inside out. So firstly, we're going to watch you doing your keepy uppies and maybe showing us a thing or two. And then me and you are going to have a little keepy uppie. Right. Challenge. Well, the Sam's it. actually winning at the minute. She got over 30, so I lost track of counting. She's actually winning. Um, I actually beat Jill Scott and a few. I'll just put that <laughs> out there. I'm doing quite well. I'm a little bit tired, actually. Um, so yeah, you you go ahead. We're gonna watch you. You're on the limelight now, and then me and you're gonna have a challenge. Yeah. Well, I've just done a session now, so I'm gonna blame the ta the <laughs> my legs, right? Is this <laughs> we Erin Cuthbert making excuses? We don't take excuse excuses. Right. Well, do you know what? I saw you and Sam try and practice the knees, so I've not got a lot of skills, but I'll try the knees, right? Yeah, the new one was really hard, what Jill said, and she made me do a roly-poly out on the question. Yeah, no, I can't do the roly-poly. Let's just stick to the Someone's just asked, out. how do we donate, Millie? If you head over to my Instagram page, um, and there's a link in my bio, guys, if you just click that, it'll take you straight to my Just Giving page. Thank you, Amy, my sister, for answering people's comments. Feel free to do so till I'm finished. Um, right, let's take it away, Ez. Right, knees, let's go. Look at her, off to a flying start. <laughs> I can't quite do the roly poly at the same time. Mind you. <laughs> You're doing well, Ez. Then you can start to jog as well. Oh, oh she's recovered it. She's rescued it. Oh. Guys, oh. anybody that has taken part in the Millie's My Day Challenge so far, if you have, of course, I'm guessing most of you might have dropped the ball by now, which is absolutely fine. Feel free to have a go at these um, little challenges that Erin's setting us. Samantha called you a show off. Uh, <laughs> Sam, um, she's been tricking us all week that she's not got skills. She's just popped out 50 knees. Um, but I'm going to give that one a go, is actually. I'm going to. Yeah, go on, let me see. Doing a simple one first. God, get me up top. Forget the <laughs> back. Get me up front. Really, right, have see. you got any tricks for us? I can just about do around the world. Um, nah, do you know what? I don't stick to basics, innit? But. You're yeah. like very much play that like, like twists and turns and yeah, it's megs and stuff like that. Step overs, quick feet, how you move and stuff. But everything you can do on the ground as well. Like you can do a little flicks on the ground, practice inside. But you can also do try to move back so you can see inside, inside, outside. Oh, somebody inside. said, Ed, can you try a rainbow flick? And I'm going to ask you to do it because you are the attacking player. So. Oh. <laughs> Can you do a rainbow flip? And if you do it, I'll try it after. Is that the one where you go? Jamie oh. Lee, hi. Jamie Lee just put hi, girlies. So I'm just saying that. What? Yeah, if, I mean, if Erin wants the defender to demonstrate the rainbow flick, I'll happily do it. No problem. Yeah, we'll try it together. Let's go. The joke is, I hope this is actually the rainbow flick. I, th I, I know, I know. I think it is. Right, I'm going to start. Oh. Oh. I've lost the ball. So <laughs> Right, I'm just going to do a few little tricks there, and then me and you are going to have a fill up. I right, get warmed up. I'm a wee bit tired, so I'm feeling uh, I've been doing this for 20 minutes now, so if anyone's <laughs> tired, I'm going to be me. <laughs> no, there. but seriously, everyone donate. It's a great cause, and it's nice to be involved in what Millie's doing, so if you can donate, 
what you can. Small or large donation is very much appreciated for Millie as well and for these little kids. Oh, outside <gasps> the window. Right, the I'm wind. just stretching the legs there. Eh? Right, are you ready? Are we having a challenge? Yeah, right, let's Before go. we do the Q&A. Right, yeah. first one to drop it. Right, also, go on. This could what? take you top of the leaderboard. You've got to get over 30. This could take 30, you top. Right, okay. right let's okay. have it. Yeah, go. Nine, ten, Guys, who do you think's gonna win? Nineteen, twenty, one. Two, three, ah! Guys, I can't cheat. I hate I dropped it as well. Window. window. I can't cheat. Oh God, I think I need a little, oh, a little breather. Gone. I'm not sure where Erin's gone. I'm back. Oh, she's back. <laughs> She's back. Have you got any other tricks before we go on to the q and I think just how to flick it up to start with, so how? Try this one. Oh, oh wait, do that again. That was silky. So, silky. 298 on film, fair play. I'm going to give you a round of applause. That is an awesome number. 198? Wow. 298. What? Thanks, Uncle Rich, for the shout out. Right, I've got one. Right, go on then. So it's right. I'm just going about this. I put loads of information on this board. I tried to be a little bit. I can just about see you. Uh, the ball. Yeah, go on. Right. Wait, I need to get the balance. Right. Wait, I'm just going to start again. So I'm not <laughs> So right, set yourself. Set yourself. It's going to. Oh my oh. days, Millie! You know that if I do that, I'm going to stand on the ball. Yeah, try again. Whoa. Oh, one more try, guys. One more try. I'm terrible. I'm, I'm not going to be able to do that either. One more try. Yes! Did it. Oh, uh, that's not me. That's um, I'm not quite flexible enough for that. I think the hip flexors just had a little tweak. So, <laughs> <laughs> right. Anyway, we're going to move on to the Q and A. But just before that, I just want to say a massive thank you for coming on here. Yeah. Uh, it means a lot to me. I think thank you on a personal level, but thank you on behalf of everyone at Make-A-Wish. Um, and thank you to all the people that are watching and taking part. Guys, don't forget, this is the shirt that you're in with a shot of winning if you donate and send me your videos across. Again, like Erin said, any donations mean the world. Um, so yeah, make sure you're sending your videos from the challenge which started at two o'clock. And don't forget to tag me and use the hashtag Millie's Match Day Challenge. I'll be reposting as many as I can this afternoon and I'll be revealing the big winner. Um, so yeah, just to finish, me and Erin are going to go through some questions. Um, if you have sent them in, just send them in again because there's quite a lot of, there's quite a few comments on here so it's hard to... Yeah, let's see what people are saying. Today. Oh, Erin, we want to see that at the first match back. <coughs> yeah. This, oh, what is it? The the scales, the flick up or the knees? I think we can go for both. I think you could try both. Do you know what? I'll, I'll try my best, but it's not really a, yeah. game, a game skill. What's it like? Uh, give me go a good Sam Kerr. Um, guys, we don't have much time left, so we have about seven minutes to do the rest of the questions. I would... If I could get more than one person on live, I would, but unfortunately I can't. What sort of training are you guys doing? Um, I've been doing, obviously, walks with Frankie Boy, my dog. I've also been taking him for runs. I've been doing uh, little football bits on the garden, um, whatever I can, and many circuits and my weight training. I've tried to make it interesting and, and fun and kind of use this time to do something different, I guess. Uh, what about yeah. you, Wes? Well, I'm the same. I was just about to come in and show you all. I've made a little bit of a home gym. Yes! Look at that for commitment. And guys, just know. so you know, it is possible to train indoors. Like, that's yeah. a great example there, Ez, that you're is, is, if you've, out of that situation. If you've not got any dumbbells, that's fine. Get, like, a, a tin of beans or something quite yeah. heavy, and then you can use that. Like, you can use, make anything and make it body weight. Do squats, do dips off the sofa. You can honestly make a session out of nothing definitely what's your favorite food you go first that's from ryan 
<laughs> well, are we talking cheap food or are we talking healthy? Like, am I trying give to us, give us both? Give us um, both. I, I think my down, it's, it's good to let your hair down. So, yeah. Um, favorite takeaway is probably an Indian. Um, nice. I like a little ch- chicken tikka masala, but don't tell the nutritionist that. Nice. <laughs> um, and healthy food, I would say. Probably a stir fry. I just like chucking so much things together and being yeah. frugal is we're away a lot. So, you know, you don't know what's in the fridge. So you just chuck in it in the fridge and definitely. Make, make a nice little meal. What about you? Um, I definitely love a seafood paella. Oh, that is unbelievable. Yes, and my yeah. feet meal would either be, I think I'd go Indian or Chinese. Love yeah, we've had, a few, we've, we've had a few Indians, haven't we? Yeah, I'd have. I'd have noodles, sweet and sour, and I love duck as well. Mm. Oh, wow. Right. No worries, Ryan. You are welcome. Um, what are the questions have we got? Let's have a look. How did you come to play for Chelsea Ladies? Um, I moved from Doncaster Bells, and to be honest, I never thought it would be possible, but I just kept striving to be better as a player um, and just making sure that I enjoyed my football and I'm very grateful that Chelsea came in for me and, yeah, I grabbed it with both hands. Wow, that's very impressive. Um, yeah, I was at Glasgow City. Not a lot, a lot of girls in Scotland make it professional and I got, you know, the chance to come down and train. Millie will remember when I came down from a yeah. little, little trial. Um, Definitely. And then got offered a contract and, do you know what, it's, it's a no-brainer. It's what every little girl in Scotland probably dreams of playing professional. So, took it and, you know, never looked back from there. And I remember during the, when we played you in Champions League, I, I always said, like, you stood out straight away just because of your pure drive. Her attitude when she came on, like, literally, she was just, like, hunting around. And I was like, you know what, you're the worst type of player to play against because <laughs> you just, like, never stop. Like, you never give in. Like, you're always keeping people on your toes. Uh, but, yeah, it's class to have Erin on board. Um, and she's a great girl inside and out, so... Melly, trust me, nobody wants to play against you either. Trust me, I'm I'm trying to go <laughs> to somewhere else in training because I ain't, I ain't getting past you. So, you know, the, it very much works both ways. This is a good question, Ez, because someone's put, do you hate being on the bench? And I think we've both experienced being on the bench. Um, I think as a player, that's it, it is tough, I think, but... Um, I know personally I've had to wait for my opportunities uh, definitely at Doncaster I was on the bench for, for quite a while until I got my opportunity but just takes a lot of hard work um, good attitude really obviously everyone wants to play everyone wants to be involved but I think in football it's a team sport so it's it's all about winning and it's yeah. all about kind of being a part of that team and I think even if you are on the bench you are a part of that team and you are just as important as the players on the pitch so um, I think try and stay strong mentally, try and stay positive um, and keep working hard. And when you do get your opportunity, make sure you take it. And I think, as you can touch on that from when you first arrived at Chelsea. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So when I first joined Chelsea, I kind of went through a period of when I was in Scotland, I was playing every game and I was used to playing every game. But then when I went to Chelsea, I kind of had to work from opportunities. But I think the main thing is be ready. Train as if you're playing. Train as if you're in the starting eleven because... You never know, you know, I, there was one time I remember in that season where Ramona got ill on the day of the game and I had to come in on the day of the game and nobody, nobody else sees that but you have to be ready mentally, physically, technically, tactically. You have to eat the same as you would if you're playing in the start and living and being ready is the most important thing and I think you build up a level of resilience when you have a period on the bench that shows that when you're ready, you don't want anyone to take that place and you're keeping that shut. Yeah, definitely. Uh, what has been your favourite game this season? <laughs> Conti Cup final, 100%. Yeah, 100%. Uh, First time winning that, it's been a long time coming. We've worked so hard to get there. Um, and I think, yeah, just, I think the, I think for me, looking back, it's, you know, the desire and the belief that the team showed, like when we conceded and then that last minute winner, that best scored, I think you could just see the whole team pushing forward. And within myself, I knew, I knew we was going to get that because of everyone's drive, everyone's, yeah. you know, passion for the game. You could just see it, like, when you zing that ball down the line. It's, you know what I had in my mind when you did that, when we played what? City and you put Fran in? I, had oh, same, I remember that. Yeah, yeah, it was literally the same. So, um, <laughs> definitely the Conti Cup beating Arsenal. Um, but I think every game's a great game. I think, you know, the quality of women's football is, is going up and up and up and it makes yeah. every single game hard. It makes every single game interesting to watch um yeah. yeah the game's growing so much so that is definitely my favorite game but i just yeah. love playing week in week out 
So we've no. got, we'll have a couple more and then we will wrap that it up. Away as well. Remember that one. Um, um, which one is that, sorry? Are still away. We yeah, uh, it's a intense. <laughs> intense. Um, <laughs> let's scroll to the bottom. We've got two more. Hit me. Um, let me make this one. Let me, there's just a lot of comments. Right. Uh, what's your post match meal? Ooh. Well, for me, I think as many carbs as possible. Yeah. But also, also protein as well because your muscles have been badly damaged. You might not see it in the outside. Your legs might not feel that bad after a game, but all the little fibres have like, torn when you play, and then you have to repair them again so that you can go again. So I think getting heap of protein in is really important, and we're lucky enough that we get it supplied to us at the stadium straight after the game. Ah, oh, this is... Um, do taking selfies at the end of a match annoy you? No, um, and that's from the bottom of my heart. I absolutely love pain. Uh, respect to all the fans and I think anyone that knows me any of the fans know that I'll do the whole stadium before I even go in and my mum's like why are you always left out <laughs> and I'm like because I'm doing the whole stadium and same for Ez I think all the Chelsea players we like to pay our respects um, and I think you know that's something in the women's game that that we have we have a kind of a close connection I'd say yeah. with the fans and yeah, you know yeah. every every single fan matters and you know I think that's the small thing that we can do back is take time out to give signatures, just say thank you, um, have pictures. So no, it definitely doesn't annoy us. Um, we really appreciate your support and we will always continue to do that. 100%, 100%. Um, even right, if one last one for Erin. Well, Let's... <laughs> Jill Scott is because you love a selfie, really. I mean... <laughs> we both <laughs> Some do. would say that, Jill. <laughs> oh, Erin, this one's for you, right? This is Erin's final question, guys. Yeah. Uh, who's your inspiration and why? Oh, that's a great question. That is a good question to finish on. Do you know what? When I was younger, I looked up to Julie Fleeton. Uh, she was in my local area. She's the most, you know, biggest goal scorer for Scotland that's that's ever been in the women's game. And she was from my local area. So I always used to see her training and playing. And I, I kind of saw behind the scenes, you know, everyone sees what people do on TV and watch, watches the games, but nobody sees someone training and all the work they put into leading up to a game so I was lucky enough to see that and actually realise wow it's not just a game I'm going to have to work hard every session and I'm going to have to put my mind to it if I want to achieve something because there's so much more work involved than what people see so I kind of realised that and she made me realise that and appreciate kind of what I have so she's been Scotland's most prolific goal scorer and I'm, I'm proud that she's from my area and just want to be like she was as well. She was at Arsenal, but hey, I'm not quite an Arsenal one, quite a Chelsea one. <laughs> <laughs> what an answer. Well, thank you so much, Ez, for coming thank on you. board and thank you for doing the Q&A. Guys, just one last message from me. Uh, thank you to everyone that took part. Please, the link is in my bio to make any donations. Thank yeah. you in advance. And uh, for a chance of winning my signed Chelsea shirt, make sure you send over your videos or post them and tag me in them. Make sure you right. use the hashtag Millie's Match Day Challenge. Do I get a chance of winning it? Because I want that top. I don't even have a same top from you. So if I'm... you send me a video. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, but thank you, good. guys. Thank you for all your questions and your lovely comments. It's hugely appreciated. Like I said, go and follow Make-A-Wish. Go check out the amazing stories and the amazing work that they've already put in. Um, and here's to the future. Thanks, yeah. Ed. Thanks for, Thanks for having me. Donate, guys. Bye, See you guys. See you soon.